But what if you knew your chances of getting cancer were higher than most people's? Ali Davis shows how genetic testing is impacting the decisions one Utah family makes. Whoa! Yeah. Sometimes wow. you find luck on your side. Whoa! And other times, oh. <laughs> it's not so simple. <laughs> 65 year old Jeff Fowler was diagnosed with breast cancer last March. You automatically go to the worst case scenario in your mind and, and you start thinking, wow, this is deadly. But the real shock came when Jeff tested positive for the BRCA2 or BRCA2 gene mutation, a variant that puts him and his family members at an increased risk for certain types of cancer. It became real when I saw the family history. Four of his uncles died of prostate cancer and two of his aunts died from breast and ovarian cancer. Intermountain Healthcare genetic counselor Emily Bonham urged Jeff to invite his family members to also be genetically tested. If you have the gene change, there will be a 50-50 chance that each of your children, each of your siblings and parents also carry that genetic change. Hey, I have cancer. It's caused by a genetic mutation that looks like it comes through dad. Jeff's sister, Kathy Jensen, took the test through a blood draw. Part of me wondered, do I really want to know? She also tested positive for the variant. I had a potentially 86% chance of getting breast cancer with this gene mutation. Kathy chose to have preventative surgery. I had my ovaries and tubes removed in August. And is having a double mastectomy this month. It's not an easy decision, but I don't want cancer. Though she is nervous, it is a big step, but it's also takes away my risks significantly. She says the knowledge is empowering. It's good to know because I have choices now. We can be more proactive when you have a family history of a health condition. Jeff's 38 year old son, Chris Fowler, tested positive too. He has five boys of his own who could also be affected by the variant and is now taking actionable steps to prevent cancer. There's things that I can do from my own standpoint to um, provide the best quality of life for myself and, and also to stay around and grow old with my boys. Chris will start screening earlier and is adopting a healthier diet like his dad. Many ways that they can control those factors um, beyond their genetics to hopefully not end up developing cancer. Bonham says understanding genetic cause can also impact treatment. Knowing about that genetic cause can lead to a more targeted treatment. Um, another medication that may work better for that cancer. Jeff had a double mastectomy and reconstructive surgery and will continue to monitor his health. It's brought a sense of gratitude to me. The Fowlers started a Facebook page to reach as many relatives as they can. It's going to be hundreds of people, if even not more over time. In hopes that cancer doesn't have a chance. I've decided I want to be around as long as I can, you know, and... Uh, I want to enjoy life. Whoa. For your life, your health. Allie Davis, KSL 5 News. Thank you, Allie. The BRCA2 gene mutation also puts Jeff at risk for prostate, pancreatic, and skin cancer.